Hi everybody. <laughs> I'm wearing a hat today. I felt like it. Is that all right? If it's not, <laughs> today I would like you to all get to know me a little bit better. I just like the idea of it, <laughs> so we're gonna do it. We've recruited um, a little bit of help today from my good friend Genevieve. Just thought of that now. Hi Genevieve. Hello. And uh, she's just gonna ask me the questions. So Genevieve, take it away. Hi. Um, I couldn't find my actual glasses, um, so we've had to go with this ensemble. Okay, back in the bag, yeah. What is your middle name? My middle name is Sarah. S-A-R-A. -A. My parents did it because apparently Julie is French for pretty and Sarah is Hebrew for princess. Feel free to vomit whenever you'd like. Genevieve? Yeah, okay. What's your favourite colour? Orange. 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 Who was your first best friend? Helena Grezo. She has a YouTube actually. She does a bit of the singing, the singing type of tin. I'll link it down below. Give it a little watch. How tall are you? I'm five foot four and a half. I cling on to that half for dear life. Five foot four and a half. Cats or dogs? Dogs, 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 and dogs, and, uh, and dogs. Funniest moment throughout school. I was an absolute embarrassment. You can take your pick. I projectile vomited in front of two classes on the language stairs. I face planted on the yard in front of the entire school and showed people my Elmo pants. I spent half a party locked in a dog cage. I'm cool. How many countries have you visited? I was actually really quite lucky um, in my early lifetime and I visited quite a lot of lovely, lovely countries until that credit crunch thing happened. Uh, then not so much, but I have been very lucky. I do hope to travel the entire world though. I wanna, I wanna go everywhere. Are you in college? I am not in college. I have finished sixth form and I have currently deferred my place at university. I am going to Newcastle University next year to study media and film. What was your best and worst subject in high school? My favourite subject at school was probably art. My worst favourite was definite definitely maths. It's just a no for me. It's a no from the Joe. I'm sorry you had to witness that. What's your favourite drink? What's your tipple of choice, eh? I am such a child when it comes to this drink. I just love a bit of apple juice. It's the simple things for me. If you're talking about alcoholic beverages, I will take a gin and tonic. That's like just me go-to. What's your favourite animal? Love a good elephant. Love a dog. Oh, I love all, all animals. Do um, I like him. Uh, I like Adam. Uh, all of them. Jolie, you stink. What's your favourite perfume? My favourite perfume, my current favourite is Givenchy Live Irresistible. It's not a very well known one, but I bloody, it's delicious. And the bottle's like rubby. <laughs> it's the simple things in life, it really is. So I like sweet, like berry, fruity scents. Am I getting paid for this or uh... anyone who, you know, thinks, oh, she'd love that perfume, comment it down below because I really want to expand my collection, but I do not know what to expand it with. So yeah, please help me. Tea or coffee? Tea, tea and tea, like just tea. Who drinks coffee these days? I'm joking, but tea. What would you name your children? I have a good few years to mull this over, definitely. I'm not even thinking about that right now, uh, to be completely honest. I do know, however, exactly what I'm naming my first pet. You know, that's like not my parents, that is mine. It's gonna be called Smithy. Just, if you don't get that reference, I don't like you. 
I'm kidding, but I don't. What sports do you or have you played? <laughs> sports, right. In middle school, I was actually very in on that athletics type thing. I was big on like the sprinting. I was in all the 100 meter relays, 100 meters. That was me, me shiznel. However, that just dies down, doesn't it? When you get in like high school and stuff. Always played netball as well. But again, just it's gone now. I do think that's a bit, bit balls. Let's change education. Right. Your favorite? book what is it i've just recently gotten back into reading i used to be a right little bookworm like the right little freak in the corner just like and i have two favorites you can't make me choose so i'm saying both of them the first one is girl on the train it's so good if you're not like really too into reading read this anyway it's a right little page turner i think i read it in three days it's just like who's gonna be the killer it's one of those it's who done it who pulled on it sorry if you're not a newcastle fan <laughs> My second favourite book is my, probably my favourite YouTuber out there. It is from the beautiful Estée Lalonde and it is Bloom Navigating Life and Style. I loved this book. If I didn't love her before, which I did, I adore her now. It's all about how she grew up, how she became this amazing person that she is. If you're sort of looking for a bit of a confidence boost and just need a bit of inspiration, this is a great one to pick up. Um, and it's just goals. It's so beautiful. I'll find like a lovely page. Oh, just yes. Do you know what I mean? Genevieve up in the place. Oh my God, I've just realized. I look like Honey G. Don't I? Oh my God. Genevieve. I'm embracing it. Honey Genevieve up in the place. Damn it. What are some of your favourite YouTubers? Me? Ooh, okay. I'm just gonna have a look in my subscriptions and we're just gonna roll them out. Genevieve, take it away. Joking. I'm saying it. Shush. It's fucking like... Shush Genevieve. If you don't watch it already, start watching the True Geordie podcast. It's so funny. Rosie Rosie, the Mishawaks, Gabby Lindley, Estée Lalonde, obviously, Casey Neistat, ooh, Jenna Marbles, Buzzfeed. Does anyone else love a Buzzfeed? Amelia Liana, Kathleen Lights, Archer Joe, Joe Weller, Tanya Bear, Zoella, Drew Monson. I look like him. Samantha Maria, the lineup, <gasps> sorted food. If you just want to eat with your eyes, sorted food, sorted food. Casper Lee, Corsair Beauty, Nina Hager, Dougie Clark, T. Jeff Bro, Allie. I don't watch Pokemon Go videos. I just don't. I think that's a good for you to keep you going. Jelly, are you single or taken? <laughs> Call me Liam Meeson's daughter, cause I'm taken. I'll wait. I'll wait. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. What's your idea of a per what? What's your idea of an what what's your idea of an ID Is this even a sentence? Sorry. Is this even a sentence? What's your idea of an ideal what's your idea of an ideal first date? Me and Tom, my boyfriend, our first date was at a beach. It was chill, you can chat, like you can talk, like the movies. Don't bother me don't bother it's outside it's like fun it's cute there's always something to do at the beach like kick about penalties draw dicks in the sand it's just good fun it's fun for the whole family how many girlfriends or boyfriends have you had ow in terms of serious real relationships one just the one in terms of you know little high school things little first school things i think like literally only three and one of them was from year two to year four we were just good friends but everyone was like oh my god you should get married so we did i'm joking we didn't he ran off with another woman do you speak any different languages if you didn't know i was actually born in wales you would expect me to speak welsh I don't. I know one phrase that my family friend Alwyn, hello Alwyn, not that you're watching, that he taught me. 
he taught me to say Merry Christmas, which is very fitting for this time of year. So, na dolly schlauen everyone. Na dolly schlauen. Apart from that, I learnt German for a year in high school. I learnt French for a bit of time. Do you have any siblings? Hmm? I know the answer. I have one sibling, he is called Jacob and he is 23. What up bro? This is his top, conveniently. How would you describe your fashion sense? I mean you have this in your wardrobe so <laughs> pretty shite. Impeccable. It's just amazing. It's so good. I think I'm still evolving in terms of my style. I love a bit of monochrome. I quite like fairly masculine styles, but made feminine, if that makes any sense. And I'm quite simple, quite simple, but yeah. What's your favorite restaurant? I like a lot of restaurants. I love food, food's my life. I'm trying not to be a basic bitch and say Nando's, but I love Nando's, like a lot, like too much like way too much. Genevieve, what do you get at Nando's? Well, cool. I get um, a medium peri-peri chicken wrap with peri-peri chips and peronese and spicy rice if I'm feeling peckish. Well, all the time. What's your order? Comment. I actually want to know because I do need want to change up my order. I've actually never ordered anything else. <laughs> Favourite TV shows? Go! Oh my god. Okay, um too many, there's so many. I'll pop random names up because can't think of any right now. Editing Julie, do me well. PC or Mac? Mac, I have a Mac. Oh my God, I look so Tumblr. <laughs> what, what, what phone do you have? iPhone, what up? Tell us one of your bad habits. Biting my toenails. I'm kidding. Buying my nails. Apart from that, I'm amazing. <laughs> so that is all. Uh, you've got to know me quite well. Say bye to Genevieve. Catch me on the X Factor at Saturday and Sunday nights. Oh, she's been voted off, hasn't she? Honey, Genevieve out. Goodbye from me, Genevieve. Bye. She's not coming back anytime soon because uh, that hat is repulsive. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked getting to know me a little bit, please click the thumbs up below. I'd like to get to know all of you, so in the comments, tell me your name, how old you are, the funniest thing that's happened to you this week. We'll all have a good laugh in the comments. Have a good day. I'll see you later. Bye. Oh my God. Question, what do you want for Christmas? A new tripod.